Hey, it's Paul here from Vanish Magic Magazine. Today on the review show, we are going to be checking out Notepad Surprise 2.0 by Sean Begonia. Free is a bird in the sky, that is what you want. Okay, I'm really excited for this review. In fact, it's one of those rare reviews that I wish I could show you uh, how it worked and the quality of the gimmick because it's so beautiful. Uh, what you get in the package? Well, you're going to get a couple of things. You're going to obviously get the instructions, uh, a download link. You get some extra bits and pieces. I won't go into those too much. You're going to get an extra notebook. You actually get two notebooks. One is completely set up, and this is the other notebook that you can easily just... Uh, when you run out of pages on the first one, you can get this. These notebooks come from Staples. Well, we have these in Canada, but in North America, Staples. But they're a, a standard size notepad. And the gimmick fits onto that particular size. So you can go in and buy a dozen of these, whatever you want. However many you think you'll get. And of course, you get the gimmicked pad. This one's already made up. As I said, it's very easy just to take the gimmick off and place it already on the other pad or what, your new pad should you run out of pages. And I should have said that it just uses a regular felt marker. So you can use any a Sharpie or I use this one that was given to me uh, just to draw the picture. And at the end, this is the great thing about this, at the end, you, as you saw, you just take this, you rip it off and you hand it straight to them. So that's the really, for me, that's the, the great thing about this is that you've just drawn it, they've just seen it come to life you in front of there's no cover you just literally in front of them tear it off hand it straight to them that really takes this to another level so let's talk about the gimmick without showing you i really wish i could uh, the version 2.0 is, is a quieter than the first one there's really no noise on this one a little bit if you depends how you handle it uh, you have the eye movement and you have the mouth movement fully under your control. As I said, left-handed or the right-handed, both doesn't doesn't really doesn't matter. Uh, but it is fully under your control. So if you're a ventriloquist, you could use this. If you're not, it doesn't matter. You can have a lot of fun. Sean does a little fun routine where the drawing talks to him and tells him he's bad at ventriloquism and whatever. But he just tears it. So uh, the, as I said, the gimmick is replaceable on different pads. Very easy to do if you can. Uh, um, or if you can, if you can, if you can wiggle your fingers, you, you can do this. Uh, the other thing is, is that uh, surrounded because the minute you put that back, you now there's nothing to see. They can't see through here. Uh, this really needs to be seen from the front anyway. So, but if people on their side, you can't see. I think Sean talked about if if you are surrounded, you just bring it into your body a little bit, bit of body covering. But really, I've been doing this, never had an issue. So who is this designed for? Well, this is designed for really anybody. Uh, if you do, it doesn't matter what sort of magic you do, you could do close-up, walk around kids' parties. It really is uh, It's designed for that. It's one of those things that packs more plays big. Very visual, of course, with the movement, it's visual. What I've been having fun with this is on social media and using it for that. Uh, great reactions for that sort of venue or, you know, uh, performance venue. For me, the big thing about this is the reaction it gets. When this comes to life, people go nuts, the kids will scream and yell, and uh, and then <clears throat> that's just the eye movement, and then uh, when you when the mouth, when it starts talking, it's a whole other level. It really gets a great reaction. It's, a, it's such a clever, clever prop. It's a great prop. Even if you're the unfunniest person in the world, you're going to get a reaction with this. Uh, as I said, he's done so much great work modifying the gimmick. It's built to last. Now, I did mention that you get 
uh, these little bands should and I've had this for quite a while now and there's never been an issue with anything but in the video just for completeness uh, should uh, as part of the mechanics of this snap or break then you get these bands these are just regular bands you can find anywhere you can replace them they show you how to do it so you don't have to worry about that it'll take a minute or two to replace the bands everything is I really wish I could show you the back of this uh, everything is it's just beautiful everything is uh, hidden out of sight so you can't see anything you just have the movement so even if somebody were to sort of quickly get a glimpse of the back of this, they're not going to really see anything. It's just black. Uh, but, you know, um, I hold it, I come out like this, and then I just open it up, turn around, I start my drawing, and then, you know, into the routine. And once it's finished, you put it away, and then the reset on this is really, really quickly, like seconds reset. It's just so easy. So you can do this strolling magic if you want to just reset very quickly. You could possibly even, I haven't tried it, I'm sure you could actually reset it in front of them. So you would do, you would come out, you would open it up, go through a couple of pages, and then you could actually, yes you could, you could actually reset it right in front of them. Um, you wouldn't want people behind you, but you could reset it in front of them very quickly and then draw your picture, come around, draw. Fantastic. Sean has really, really, you know, anything Sean does, he really gives it a lot of thought. And the thing I like about Sean is he just doesn't stop thinking. He tries to take things to the to the ultimate point, you, where you think that the original you thought, well, the original is fantastic. It couldn't get any better. Well, it just did. And so this is what you have now with this version 2.0. Gets my highest recommendation. If you're looking for something that is so fun, can be added at any time in your act, can be done surrounded, can be done for kids, adults, uh, trade shows, then you're not going to go wrong when you get Notepad Surprise 2.0 by Sean Begonia.